In this video, I'm going to go over how to add the video element to your website. So we can click the Add Element button here. I'm going to search for video. There it is. So this will implement a YouTube or a Vimeo link. So all you have to do is find the video you want to put in your website, go up here and copy it. Then down here, I'm going to delete this. And then I'm going to paste the video I want. So now you can see the video has been embedded into the site. I can change the height of the video, but keep in mind whenever you do change the height, it crops the video. So that's something to remember that if I change the height to 40% here, it still will be full width, but now some of the top portion and some of the bottom portion of that video won't be visible. So I'll need to manually change the width of the video to get that back. If I hit this X here, it automatically goes to 56 and a quarter percent. And the reason it's like that is because that is the regular uh, video aspect ratio that uh, a majority of videos are made with. It's the standard widescreen format. So we suggest you just leave it at that. And if you do want to change the size of the video, we suggest just changing the size of the column or the container that the video is inside of just to make sure that whenever view users view the video on your site, they're not missing any key material. Down here, we can change the depth. So if we want to give the video a shadow, we can do that here. We can change the hover depth as well. So if users hover over the video, you can see raises up off the page a little bit, provides a good little user interaction, good feedback so they know that this is an element that they can click. Then down here, we have class. If you're familiar with CSS, you can give a class name right here, uh, which you can then go in and target in the custom CSS editor in the site. And then last, we have we have visibility down here. So if for some reason you don't want this to show up on certain devices or you only want it to show up on certain devices, you can do that right here to make sure that everybody has the best experience on your site, no matter what device they're on. Once you're all finished, once you're happy with your settings, you can hit apply, you can hit update. Now that video is live on your site. If you have any questions about videos or anything else, feel free to contact us. We'll be happy to help you out. Thank you.